Let's get started with integrating the A1 tracking onto your Recharge app on Shopify. As a first step, we need to edit the Recharge checkout page. Recharge has a dedicated support team for this, so we will go ahead and create a new request for them for this access. Type Recharge Support Ticket on Google and click Submit a Request. Type in your store name and submit. Choose API integrations and advanced customization in the drop down list. Fill in your email address, leave the topic empty, and feel free to mark it as an urgent issue. Let's type access to JavaScript on page one for the subject and something similar to this in the description. Please ensure you ask for edit access and accept liability as we have been advised by ReCharge that this is a part of their standard process. Submit the ticket and wait for ReCharge's response. Once ReCharge has given the access required, we can now add the tracking scripts onto our Shopify store. Let's go to Awin's wiki and search for Shopify FAQs. Once on the page, scroll down to number 7 and open the ReCharge PDF file. Here is the guide that will help you implement the tracking correctly. Let's copy the snippet on the first page and find the file we're after, which is the subscription cart footer liquid file. I'm going to paste it here where the build checkout URL function is as the next step after this would be to change this function. Please ensure that you do not paste the copy snippet inside an existing function. So make sure there's enough space before you paste. Go ahead and paste it. Now that's done, let's go back to our PDF guide for the next step. Copy the second snippet, which is the build checkout URL function. We will be replacing the old one with this new one. Carefully remove the existing function like so and paste the new snippet in the same space. Once that's done, save the changes. Now we go back to our guide for the final integration step. Copy the conversion script. Go to your apps, open recharge, and go to the recharge checkout settings. Scroll down to the thank you page box and paste the copied snippet here. Please ensure that the X's are replaced with your own unique advertiser ID. Once that's done, we go back to our guide one final time to copy the final snippet. 
This is the snippet we paste into the JavaScript on page one box. Paste in this box and again, replace the X's with your advertiser ID. Now save the changes. Now that everything is implemented, let's run a test transaction using the AWIN click link. You can obtain this link using the tracking diagnosis tool on AWIN. Paste this link into your address bar and hit enter. On your website, choose a subscription product and add to cart. Move to the checkout and fill in the necessary fields. Continue to the final payment step. Type in your payment details, but before placing your order, right click anywhere on the page and select inspect. This will open the developer tools and will help us in reviewing the test transaction. Go to the network tab and filter by SREAD. Leave it open and continue to place your order. Once the order has been confirmed, we can look at our conversion script. And when you scroll down, you can see we now have everything that is needed. And that's all. Please let your integration analysts know you have now completed the implementation and they will do their final checks.